All right, guys. Uh, I'm just going to give you kind of a quick review. Um, this is on my Droid 3, and uh, this is a Steel Droid. So I want to go through this thing and just kind of tell you about it. Um, and if you want to install, you can. Uh, the install process on this is with Safe Strap uh, 2.1, and <clears throat> It is basically the same process you've seen on my other installs, and you can watch a custom install video too for custom ROMs. It's the same process. It's really easy. You just wipe it all three your uh, your big three, and then you flash your ROM. So pr pretty simple. Just make sure you're in safe strap. So this is what this is. This is Droid uh, three, and this is Steel Droid, and it's version 4.8. Can be found over at DroidForms.net. Um, I'll put links and everything like that in the description so you can see what's going on. So this is um, basically based off of Droid 3 stock right now um, and it just has some tweaks in it. So you can see here we have some toggles up here that are actually scrollable back and forth. Um, so that's kind of neat. Got some custom you know icons up here. So you got those things, you got some folders like this where you can actually see what's in the folder, which is kind of cool down here. It's your weather widget, it's your app drawer here. Um, so a couple things about the app drawer is kind of neat. When you actually transition, the app drawer kind of fades and reappears. The apps, I should say, kind of fade and reappear. Uh, your, your, your apps in here are pretty much your standard stuff. The only thing really different is off of stock is super user and DSP manager. Um, and then it took out a lot of that bloat that was in there too. So, um, just pretty standard, standard applications there. One thing that's cool in the app drawer that is neat is this run feature right here. Or running, I should say. It just shows you what's running. And you can come in here and click them out and close them out. Um, so you don't have these applications running. Uh, so I like that. I think that's kind of a neat little thing just built into the app drawer. So let's go into some other things here. We're going to go into launcher settings. This thing is the uh, Nemus launcher. It's not a lot of settings in here. It's pretty basic launcher. You know, you got some home screen things, stuff like that. Um, so, like I said, nothing, nothing too terribly exciting. Um, so let me show you some other things on Nemus launcher. It's kind of neat. Is this dock down here? You can scroll and put different icons down there. So you have three different docks basically you can scroll through. I don't have any on the other dock, but you can you can add them in there. So like camera, I think we can take this. See now you got it down there in that other dock. So pretty neat. Um, everything seems to be working in this. I don't see any issues with it. Um, pretty pretty solid uh, ROM here. Uh, let's go into settings. Hopefully you guys can actually see this. I know it's really bright. Uh, about phone. And it just shows that we're on system version um, 5.7.906. And it's Android 2.3.4 on the Droid 3. And again, Steel Droid 4.8. Um, so that's pretty much your stuff there. Uh, you can see your dialer is pretty much standard. Texting standard, it's all the Verizon versions of everything. Um, but you have root and a uh, nice little launcher and some nice little customization uh, toggles and stuff like that. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. That is Steel Droid. Um, if you want to uh, install and check it out, might as well. It's really easy to do. Check it out, see if you like it. If you do, run it. Um, might want to look into a different launcher. I think Emus launchers are right, but. I like some of the other ones better. This thing doesn't have enough features for me. So, but yeah, check it out. See if you guys like it. Uh, thanks.